Okay, this is Big Baby J with another episode of Final Fantasy XII The Zodiac Age. I made a change in plans. I wasn't going to take out Chaos before I went to Draco Laboratories. I was going to wait to Alpha, but I decided to change my mind. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and take care of him now. But before I do, there's one little errand I need to take care of. Uh, I think I got all my... Uh, Pinewood chops. So let's take a look. Yeah, I got all of them. 28. I did that off screen. I mean, it's an easy side quest. It's just long and boring. So I didn't want to put that on a on a gameplay. So yeah, but it's easy to do. You can't make any mistakes. So all you have to do is match the people up. Now I'm gonna change this uh, pinewood chop into sandalwood chop. Now, let's progress this game just a little further, and uh, let's go take out Chaos. Ah, so pleased you could join me. Jules had a morsel for us. A light airship used by Draglord researchers is just up ahead. Well, we'll take that and go in through the service entrance. Let's make haste, shall we? With that, Balthier is back in the party. So. Complices of the Senate have been quelled, Your Honor. Our forces sustained but light casualties. You have leave to withdraw. One detachment will remain here to guard Draglaw. My Lord. Do you think they're on to us? It would seem not. Though this will make our task more difficult still. Okay, up here, the reason why I got my sandalwood chop is because later on, once uh, Draclaw is complete and you start the uh, red trophy game hunts, you can come up here and uh, visit this area. But without that uh, sandalwood chop, you wouldn't be able to do so. Certainly took your time getting here, didn't you? Off sight, seeing the sights perhaps? Not likely. Do you know how long it took to get the chops to get up here? What's that? But I gave Jules some chops. Jules? Tis, tis. A squad of, a squad of judges has been sent to Draclor. You'll find the service entry rather a difficult proposition, I'm afraid. You're doing, no doubt. You knew how the Ministry of Law would move, so you had Von out collecting chops until the judges could reinforce Draclaw, of course. Tell me, how much did the Ministry pay for word of the prodigal son? The Ministry? Oh, judges make poor customers, my friend. Too many rules, too many laws. Perhaps you didn't know, Master Balthier, that Draclaw is a toy box of these days, filled with your lower father's conceits. All developed without the Senate's knowledge, of course. Why not even the Emperor knew the full extent of Dr. Sid's operations? Now there's the catch. Since Vane had himself declared dictator, Nera Peep has come out of that laboratory. I know the people who, who will sell their own mum for the mere scrap of information about the goings-on inside Draclor. 
people like Rosaria and sympathize worried about the Emperor's weapons programs and anyone else who might be opposed to House Solidor's hegemon hegemony. So we create a disturbance and get your windfall of dirt on Dracmore. In exchange for our, your service, I've spoken to the cabbie. When he asks where you want to go, tell him you know where to where to go. Simple, no. Ah, uh, a deal broken in true Arcadia's fashion. Why it's just like old times, Jules. Brings a tear to my eye. Good to be back, eh? My, my regards to your loyal father, Master Framran. Or uh, rather, Master Balthier. And none, and none. Okay, we're not gonna take that cab. It's time to go to the Deadlands. So, let's get ready for uh, chaos, shall we? Let me see what I got equipped real quick. Ice cloud arrows. Let's change that to. Uh, she got the bamboo arrows. Let's go over here. Put that on you. Put this on you. Well, whisker, bone of Biblius. We're good. Let's continue. Uh, let me check my gamut. Uh, nope, I don't want that. We're gonna take the nearest one close. About there, why aren't you doing anything? Oh, I forgot. My bad. That's better. See how easy these guys are to take out now since I'm all leveled up and everything. Couple of shots and it's over with. <laughs> now, what we gotta do is talk to this Toad King over here. We talked to him before, they got the got it all started see this guy here that guy there we got the medallions for these two guys now we need to talk to uh, Mekili I've spoken to Romaku and uh, Ro Menu, and we're in agreement the hero we have waited for is you the medallion of bravery has spoken to Rokamenu and the medallion of love Rokinmu they both speak your name the key must go to you Two years ago, Netherside destroyed the city. From the wailing mist left in the wake of destruction, three fell beasts emerged. Humbaba, fury, and chaos. Beasts with strength enough to lay waste to the entire world loose by the human rage. We survived the fall of Nabides and found the beasts waiting. After a battle spanning many days, we are last seer of them within the ruins. We changed the keys of the seers into medallions, secreting, secreting them away where they would remain safe. But the midst of the ruins grow deeper, grows deeper with each passing day. In time, the bonds will weaken and break. We will not be able to repair them again. We must seek the we see the medallions in the hands of a hero who might defeat the beasts. The prophecy foretold of coming of a hero, and a hero is come. The medallions of love and bravery had named you that hero. 
only medallion of might remains. In fact, it waits here in Nabidu's Deadlands. The medallion of might rests within a small shrine in a holy place we call Overlooking Eternity, where it waits for the hero to find it. Once a bridge rose from there to this holy place, but it's no more. You must cross the Deadlands afoot to reach it now. By reaching this holy place, you will prove. By reaching this holy place, you will prove you are worthy of the medallion of might, hero. There, in overlooking eternity, we will wait your coming. Welcome you. Yep, let's go. Yeah, how convenient that the ma the uh, bridge is right over there. It's just it's hanging over there. Now we got to go all the way around. Do you remember that area where I was doing some leveling up with those skeletons? Yeah, we're going, we're going there again. So, let's make our way over there. Yeah, don't over, don't underestimate those bases. They work pretty good, especially when you got the right equipment, because they deal damage according to the magic power you which you have. So the more magic power you have, the more damage they do. This is where I got the Randall, but I'm not going to do it now. I did it earlier. I catch it in my previous episode on how to chain these uh, Banshees and Bellaloo. That's where you get the, uh, the Randall from. Of course, you know, this is where I did my leveling up. And I'm leveling up again with these skeletons. This time I'm not stealing. I'm just going to kill this time around. But I can't use the opal ring, so therefore I would not be casting uh, oil and fire. I just take them out the old fashioned way. Because right now, Bob Thier can cast Farga and so can Fran. Let them hit that old oil. These guys will, will be a piece of cake. But as you see, it doesn't, it doesn't even matter now. They ain't. And not even get a chance to attack now. Ah, uh, let's fix that uh, blindness right up. Yeah, let's fix that. You know what? I'm not going to sleep no time soon. Let's go here. Here. And here. I'm not going to sleep. Alright. Are the one chosen by the medallion of love and bravery visits us. You will find the third, the medallion of might within the shrine. Take it. Ah, uh, love and bravery. They too are keys. Keys which grant access to great beasts that wait that wait in Nagarha of Navides. Take them. That you are here at all is proof enough of your worthiness. The medallion that sleeps in the shrine is yours. Seeing the medallions in the hands of the Chosen was our final task. Now we may rest. Slay Humbaba 
fury and chaos. Restore silence to this necro hall. Nobody is, is become. Do this in our memory. Okay, let's make our way out of here now. Color type. That's another ingredient for the uh, corner soul. Although I have just about everything I need. Matter of fact, I want to take care of that it type. So, let's do so. Nope, still from that guy. Alright, now uh, we equip this back. Look how quickly he falls. I got a scar tight. Let's see if I get a war guards band. Not yet. I only got two left. Well, down to one now. And I didn't get one. Oh well. I got all I need anyway. Now for a little float.
getting that loot your partner stole my other one I ain't gonna keep stealing my loot I ain't gonna keep letting that happen Dead for real. So look the Masa. I can make some more high arc on it if I wanted to. Not that I need to. Okay, the first trial right here. You wanna examine him so you can use a McDonald's in love. First up is Fury. Fury, yeah, as you see, it's little bunny. It's a little hype in that uh entrance, wasn't it? Thought we was really finna fight something. Actually, you are. You just don't realize it yet. Uh, all right, Balthier. I mean, Bosh. See if we can steal a little something from him. Balthier, I need you to dispel him ASAP. Now I go ahead and put my uh, bro tip it back on. Not that I'm gonna get any experience from this. Ah, do that again. Spare him. One more time. But that berserk is no joke. All right, one more time. And it's over with, just like that. And he gonna cry on his way out. He was just trying to kill me, he gonna cry on his way out. You ain't get no sympathy. Not from me. Okay, let's grab this little uh, chest here. Golden axe. Best axe in the game. Of course, I already got the best hammer in the game, which is uh, a little stronger than that axe. Or do I? Let me check that out. Double check that.
Oh no. It's the second. It's third. That's the second. Okay. It's third. Correction. Next up, the behemoth. Bah. Humble bah. <laughs> Okay, float again. He would hit ball there, wouldn't he? I will put that uh Yaku dot blade to to some use. Yeah. Might well use it. <laughs> yeah, I like the way that worked out. All right, go back to the bone of Biblios. <laughs> Good, you hit the right one that time. Yeah, you hit the right one that time. This time we get to fight the big guy. Bob here. Same trick. Yeah, that's big step. 
right up. Rand just had to go and take him out, didn't she? Four hit combo. Killed by his own sword. Let's go get, should be a mega elixir here. Ouch. Nope, it's game mode. Okay. Tippies on and show don't take long to level up. Yeah, I'm almost back up to 80 with the rest of my crew. I can let that disable wear off. Please be escape mode, and it is. Yeah. Oh, I had to hit friend, huh? All right. Let's see here. Uh, friend, go ahead and use a high ether. Now, it's time, yeah, time to change party members. Uh, you can use, what magic can you use? Let's see. Because in this fight, I'm going to be using magic. Uh, you can use... Nothing that I can use. So, not gonna be doing. Wait a minute. Hold on. What kind of techniques you got? You got Soul Eater. You can do Soul Eater. And we'll put you on the highest max HP. That way you can take care of the boss. Alright. I need to get Balthier out. Bosh out. Sorry, Bosh. You gotta go. Canelo, come on in here. Let's equip you. What do I need to equip you with? You know what? That's what I need to equip you with. Fran, you as well. I don't want to be silenced. Can't take that chance. And Thief's Cups. 
Oh. Also, let's go ahead and equip y'all with y'all. Nope. Where is it? There we go. Want you to have one. And I want you to have one. Now, what I need to do is, is give y'all uh, this right here. Where is it? There we go. That's what I want. I'm going to have y'all take out the lowest ones first. Then, you can take out the big guy. Then we're going to get those elementals out the way first. They're nuisances. They're really just getting in the way. Okay. You still can cure. You got remedy. You know what? The, no. Let's give you a remedy though. Yeah, you need a remedy. I'm gonna put Bosch under remedy as well. That cure up everything that I had when I put him back in the party. Okay. I think I'm ready now. Let's get chaos. Right here. <clears throat> well, I'm still first. Alright, now equip you with the power omelet just in case he decides to uh, use that uh, stop on me. Can't be having it. Oh, one more thing. Uh, let's raise your. This is a lot higher. Because I want you to cure before Canelo. Canelo's gonna be hitting hard. I need her to attack. Yeah, this. Okay, now you using yours. I might well use mine as well. Use a mischarge on him. See how well I can get. How high I can get. Okay, yeah. We gonna try him out. There's a proper way to do everything. Here she comes! You have to be kidding me. You 
talk about unlucky. Okay, now, let's go ahead and give you your, no, where was your back? I need you to have that back. Uh, you can get that back. Oh, yeah, you need your bow back too. I'll make you the part leader this time. There. Your best. There's the mega elixir. Now. Oh, let's go ahead and uh, see who's going to get this guy. Not going to be fun. Maybe. Same thing. I'm still got to decide what I'm gonna do with him. Uh, you know what? That might not be a bad idea. Yeah, that's a good possibility. Reach by 350. Yeah, I'm gonna give it to Ash. I really don't need a holy. I don't cast holy at all anyway. So Fran wouldn't benefit from it no way because I'm not gonna use holy at all in this game. If I do, it'd be a holy mode. So yeah. I mean, Black Mage would probably a. Uh, would a friend would have probably made a better choice, but if you notice in my whole gameplay, I don't use any buffs, so it will actually be a waste for Fran. Now, if you use buffs, it'd have been perfect. Chugga, uh, Protecta, been perfect. If you use a uh, Holy, would have been perfect. But uh, let's just be honest, I don't use. Holy gun. Holy because it takes so long to cast and you only gonna cast the on one enemy. Oh, I forgot. You need to be out of here. I need to change your gamut back too. Okay, now let's get out of here. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. See if I can get another skate mode. There's a possibility. Let's see. 
Now you're gonna be lucky twice. Before we leave, let's see what the vendor, if he got anything new, new now. Check him out, see if he got anything. I used to come out. Vendor is always in this location right here. I don't think I mentioned it in my previous video, but yeah. Just in case I didn't, this is where you'll find them. What do you got? Parallel arrows, fiery arrows, longboats. Uh, I got all that. I got all that. We good. Now let's get out of here. Now we can take on Drac Lord Laboratories. But it will be next episode, not this one. Nope. Nope. Now, I can't wait to get those assassin arrows. In my opinion, those are the best arrows in the game. And they work very well against Fafnir. Use assassin arrows or the Mina on uh, Fafnir, you got a chance of instantly killing him. He got it. Stop stealing my loot.
I get a war guys band this time around. We shall see. Roman Cavados. That's Brave Invoke. <laughs> and you get as many as you want. Actually, all you gotta do is zone in, zone out. I said it before, I'm just saying it again. And I guess I won't get no war guys buying. Uh. All right, let's go back to Arcadia. That's where I'm going to end it. I catch you guys later on the next episode. Take care.